So we often get asked, what's the difference between UEBAs and SIMs? And a lot of times, you know, we, we have to think about that for a minute. Well, let's go back to why SIMs happened. What was the purpose? If you go back, turn the clock back a little bit, what was the big problem organizations were facing? that there were logs that were coming from half a dozen to a dozen different sources where people would have to go investigate. Sims came along and said, you know, that's, that's a challenge. What we're going to do is we're going to take all of that log data and we're going to dump it into one place and we're going to organize it for you. So instead of looking at 12 different consoles, we can go look at one. We want to borrow the needle in a haystack because that's effectively what security organizations are trying to do. We're actually taking 10 different piles of hay, putting it all together and creating one big pile of hay. And we're saying, hey, all your needles are going to be in this giant pile of hay. Now enter analytics. Analytics, the whole purpose of analytics is to find the needle. So if you apply analytics to that giant pile of hay, it'll say, hey, in this 75% of hay, there aren't any needles there. Go look in this 20%. In fact, what analytics can do, if implemented properly, will show you the really sharp needles from the dull needles. Ultimately, you got to figure out from an IT perspective or from a security perspective, what is the problem you're trying to solve? Is your problem, I have too many haystacks and I want to aggregate hay? Or is the problem I want to find needles? One problem is solved by SIMS, the other one is solved by analytics.